Well, right now, dozens of musicians are paying tribute to the musical legend at the Howlin' Wolf. Yeah, David Russell Batiste Jr. died of a heart attack at age 57. Earlier today, he was laid to rest. Lily Cummings was there for the second line to heaven. Family, friends, and fellow musicians poured out of St. Catherine Drexel Catholic Church and onto Louisiana Avenue in a display of love for David Russell Batiste Jr. I'm just blessed and, and, and honored, you know, to, to know that my nephew was so loved by so many people. And so John came down, you know, and the whole family came together today. It's a sad occasion, but we do thank the city of New Orleans for showing the love that they have shown for Russell. Batiste was known for his remarkable talent on drums. It would make everyone play better because Russell was so on top of every little beat. He was, he was a genius drummer. He played with countless acts across New Orleans and the world, many of which showed up to pay their respects. Russell's been my drummer for the last two years. He, he took my music to another level. Fellow St. Augustine alumni were there as well, including members of the city council who honored Batiste's contributions to the community with a proclamation. Even though he went throughout the world, basically promoting the city of New Orleans, promoting himself. He found time to be involved with something such as an alumni band and to participate in activities here in the city. We will be always grateful for his love for the city and his contributions. The second line marched Batiste from the funeral towards his resting place. Not only will he be remembered as a renowned musician, Batiste's loved ones say his strong, generous, and bold personality will be missed. I remember Russ always being very special and unique since I was a child. And I think all of us and all of those here to support appreciated that part of Russell the most, I would say. A New Orleans legend, gone but not forgotten. In Central City, Lily Cummings, Eyewitness News.